this is the pond uh, the second day it's filled up it's filled up with a little help from the creek as you can see it filled up basically from this morning and they have a ramshackle kind of little barrier here to collect water for and the water's running back into this reservoir and it will run back into the creek tomorrow. You can see a little bit of agitation there. Seems to pump the water back out for some reason. Let's look at that. See the ripple in the water? garbage out of it, I guess. So, there's water running out because it's too much. So, down in the ditch is the hydraulic ramp. That's the wastewater. And if you follow this yellow garden hose, Bottle the garden hose. This panorama of all the uh, beautiful plants. The barn and the mud, it just rained. I don't need to irrigate anymore, but follow the magic. It's got a sound, it's got a metallic twin. And we'll go look. You can't see the water, but there's water. To see it is to believe. It's not a lot of water. But it is water. <laughs> you can see it pulsate with the uh, the action of the uh, hydraulic pump, hydraulic ram pump. <laughs> it just spurts up. It was turning around at one point, but it stopped. But I mean, it is uh, it's definitely a slow amount of water. But uh, um, the theory is now working. After a great deal of mud. And you can hear the metallic sound of the hydraulic ram, and you can see it pulsate a bit, as I can see it. Now, of course, what to do with that water? 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Water being pumped. That's all.